And the winner is Eco Banner. Eco Banner is a social enterprise that uh, manufactures biodegradable sanitary towels using banana fibers. Most of us in the company are men. I hope this is. So as men who we were doing this work, it was quite a challenge for us because we could, we, we could explain to somebody that we are men and we are doing this for girls and women and they'll be like, are you serious? Is it you? Come on. My name is uh, Lennox Ensenomondi. I'm a third year student at St. Paul's University. I'm the founder and CEO of Ecobana Limited. Ecobana is a social enterprise that uh, manufactures biodegradable sanitary towels using banana fibers. It is a student-led and a youth-led uh, social enterprise that seeks to end period poverty in Kenya and also in Africa. And uh, we started the project after the presidential speech on uh, the 20th of October, the Heroes Day, uh, when Uru Kenyatta awarded uh, a mother of three from Marsha Beach who couldn't afford sanitary towels and uh, resorted to use rugs and also to use uh, chicken feathers uh, to curb her girls' menses. Uh, to us, that was a challenge because uh, we are a group of students who believe in uh, giving back to the society. We also have a mind for business and a heart for the world. We do even training for boys, even men, because a uh, society is not made for only for women. It is made for all of us. And uh, as we believe in Kenya, we say, umoja ni nguvu. We are using a concept of green and circular economy, where one man's waste is another man's treasure. And in this method, we are using the banana trunks, which could have been left to rot into the ground emitting high amount of CO2 into the atmosphere to make uh, sanitary towels, but we didn't have enough resources to pull out the masses for raw materials and production. So in 2021, we got a seed funding from KCIC, the Kenya Climate Innovation, and uh, that's when we started the mass production of our biodegradable sanitary towels. The process starts where we get the raw materials, that is the banana trunk. Uh, we cut them into smaller pieces and also sort them so that we can be able to squeeze the juice out and get the banana fibers. Once we get the banana fibers, we do the second stage of sorting, removing the thick and also the, uh, the part of the banana trunks which did not turn into fibers. Once we have the fiber, uh, we cut the fiber again into smaller pieces, dry into the sunlight. Then now we go to the third step where we now make the banana pulp. We'll be cutting the pulp into smaller pieces uh, decompose it for two to three weeks and also dry it again. After drying it again, we repulp it back again. Once we have the banana pulp, we'll be using the pulp to shape uh, the sanitary towel in different positions from thick, maxim, and to the light. Then from that point, we'll be able to start to make our sanitary towels. We are 95% effective and 91% uh, cheaper. You know, we used to have those gl gloomy days when you're just wearing pads and you're like, oh my God, I'm so uncomfortable. When will my periods end? But right now, that is all gone. I mean, this thing is so comfortable. You can, I can actually start jumping, jumping around because you can see actually I'm happy. I'm super excited. I'm on my period. I'm wearing this same, same part. But then right now, it's so comfortable. I'm one of those people who use the fat sample. We are, we, we, you cannot get a pad cheaper than 50 shillings. With Ecobana, it's only 43 bob. So anybody can afford it. Uh, we are selling at uh, 0.43 dollars. That, that is uh, 43 Kenyan shillings. And also that's a retail price. But uh, for the wholesale price for somebody who works with an organization, we sell at uh, 0.39 dollars. That is 39 shillings. We have partnerships with uh, right now 11 girls schools. So we produce uh, only for the 11 girls schools. We competed at the Hull Prize Johannesburg Regional Summit. Among the 197 teams that were present, we were able to become position one. 
Our second award was the Kiambu Youth Innovation and Entrepreneurship Week and also became position one. We also won a recommendation letter by the Kiambu County Government, which was signed by the Governor. Another award was uh, the Kenya Climate Innovation Design Thinking Clean Tech Competition, which was held at Strathmore University. Uh, we also became position one winning the accolades and also winning a seed fund of 900,000 Kenyan shillings for uh, our business incubation. Uh, our fourth award was uh, the St. Paul's University Innovation and Entrepreneurship Week, which we also became position one and uh, got partnership with the university. Our last award so far that we've been able to garner, the one that we got just recently, was uh, also the on-campus awards from the Health Press Foundation. We emerged position one, East Africa, uh, the best team in north of Sahara, south of Limpopo, and also we'll be able to present and represent the country Kenya and our university, St. Paul's University, at uh, the Global Accelerator, which will take place in uh, Boston, Massachusetts. And the winner is Eco Banner. Doors because we are now connected to the United Nations and also to the UNICEF and also be able to meet our investors and also at our, our partners later in September in New York at the United Nations headquarters. We didn't have enough resources to get us where we are right now. We really had a hard time getting the raw materials because all the raw materials we couldn't get them from one area. We had to travel and do our social mapping. The second challenge was the challenge of getting the machines to do the work but we resorted to do the work manually where we used our own hands. So we really had a challenge of doing a mass production. We were only doing like uh, 300 sanitary towels, maybe in a month. We'll be having our products available on Jumia and also other retail stores that are online. We are now targeting to make egg trays, doormats, paper and gift hampers made of banana fibers. I would like to thank St. Paul's University administration and the management. I would also want to thank my team. Special shout out to our patron. I want to thank our parents. They've been very supportive. For somebody to come up with such a crazy idea in Kenya and tell your parents you want to do it, apart from education, they'll tell you you're joking. <laughs> and as I said in the pitch, what we are truly passionate about is our impact. I would also like to thank the Hard Press Foundation for believing in us and uh, giving us an opportunity to represent country and also our university at the global accelerator levels. To reach us, you can get us on the social media handles, that is Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and also on LinkedIn as Ecobana Limited. Or you can send us an email at ecobana at gmail.com. I want to challenge men that uh, menstrual space and menstrual hygiene is not only a woman's problem to solve. And manufacturing biodegradable sanitary towels is my hassle.